Hello guys and girls, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, this is Jernigan here. As you can see, I've got my lights in my room. I do sleep quite a lot. I don't know if you guys and girls, ladies and gentlemen, sleep a lot yourselves. As you can tell, I've just woken up. I used to get up in the morning. But it's just too many late nights for me. I don't know if you guys and girls have the same thing, ladies and gentlemen, the same thing. Watching TV, computer gaming and watching films most of the night. And that's why you miss getting up at a reasonable time. We can all do this, and uh, some people say get up a bit earlier. It's about training your body. As you can see, that's the time now. One in the afternoon. Uh, apart from me sleeping in bed, I had a dream last night, like most people do. Some people don't remember their dreams, but uh, I was basically on my road in Shuffle and Ifnal. And I was doing like loads of missions in my dream, and basically I went to uh, this guy in the dream. And, uh, basically, I was doing, like, missions on a game in the dream, going to different places. Like, it's like going to different worlds in the dream, but, uh, I was, like, in different time zones, in the same time zones. It was all confusing. A bit like Doctor Strange, really, and Doctor Who. In my own dream, in my own way, but, uh, uh, basically, I know you can't see very much at the moment, and I'm talking, and you can see the room, but you can't see my face, but, uh, I am a bit tired today. So, uh, basically, um, in my dream, um, I went to uh, everywhere, I uh, spoke to people in the dream, I went into this place, into a shop, and it was like being on a ferry in the dream, it wasn't as such being on a ferry, I spoke to people on, in the shop and on the ferry, they said we're almost there now, and I said to them where we're going now, and I asked them, do you want to go there again, and they said, uh, no. Nope. And the dream was very vivid and stuff in the dream. And basically, I uh, spoke to people. I was in like this hospital, and this uh, thing kind of reminded me of the uh, Uncharted game or Laura Croft game. It was like a big um, hill or a mountain. And I was looking down it, and I was trying to talk to people, and they were like saying, Yes, this is in the Roman days, and soldiers defended this uh, place in the Roman days. And I was talking to the man about his uh, girlfriend. And I said, congratulations. And he was a bit shy about it. He didn't want his friends to hear what was going on in the dream. And I said, don't worry about it. You know, congratulations. You've got a family now and everything else. And, you know, I was kept speaking in the dream. Going to different areas and going to different places. And, uh, you know... It's like trying to tell me things. I mean, I've seen a lot of things on TV. I've seen a lot of history. And uh, sometimes you remember our things and sometimes you don't. Um, I went onto a bus in the dream with a load of people. We were talking and they're travelling somewhere else. And I don't know if I was in heaven. I didn't feel like I was in hell anyway. But uh, I... I just thought I'd share my experience of my dream with everybody on here. Um, some people probably don't remember their dreams, but uh, everybody thinks differently and sees things differently from other people. And you know, um, like I say, you can probably hear a car in the background and shift, not if not, like mm, bloody motorbikes again. But yeah, um, there are lots of us, or thousands of us, or millions of us dream every night, and some of us don't remember our dreams, and some of us do. But, like I say, I wanted to share my experience of my dreams again, which I usually do sometimes. Some people don't remember their dreams when they sleep. They forget. And, uh, you know, um, i tell you what, my head is throbbing. I don't drink, obviously, or smoke. Perhaps I need to drink more water and stuff, apart from that. And, you know, my head, my head is there. Uh... <laughs> I could get out of bed. Usually in the winter you can't get up. You can in the summer better, but yeah, um, apart from not getting out of bed, that's a, a relevant, a different thing, but um, I'll probably have more dreams again and more ideas that I probably will share with people. Some people will be interested, some people probably won't be, but you know, I've got to try and think of more. It's your imagination at the end of the day. That's how you remember these dreams and things, what you do. And what you see in your, your mind and stuff. Because your imagination. Um, 
I'm going to try and get to bed early tonight, guys and girls. Hello, boys and girls. Um, it's not easy. I, obviously, I woke up at half past 12 again. Um, I'm having a bit of a problem. I just can't get out of bed for some reason. See, I know I'm having too many late nights. I know that's a problem for me. And I'm trying to figure out what. There's my footage. You can see there's the fan. Uh, the fan in my room. You can see the light shining on it from the lamp. I'm just trying to think what else I can say in the video, to be honest. Um, I'm sure I'll find a figure or think of something to say. I mean, some people have plenty to say, some people don't. Um, you know, uh, I know I'm saying a lot of ums today, but I'm just trying to think of other things. I watched a bit of news yesterday on the TV, as I do, on the PS4. A bit of YouTube. Um, about will England get ready or prepare for war in a couple of years' time. And um, will they have to go through France and Germany and Poland before they get to us? I mean, they get to us eventually. So I'm throwing that in the mix and what I'm speaking about. Uh, you know, I've got a lot to say for myself, as you can tell. I'm just trying to think of other ideas and stuff to say. As you can see, this is my pillow here. This is a, a bit like Dragon Ball Z. Well, I'm not really a fan of Dragon Ball Z. So I'm basically putting the pillow on me here, as you can see. I'm resting and talking on the phone. TV's over there. Feet on the bed, so you can look on the bed. It's a bit blurry in the room, I know. Um, like PS4 Castle over there, as you can tell. PlayStation 4 now. Um, what Belly keeps rumbling, I'm hungry as well, so I have to get some food in a minute at some point and get out of bed and stuff. The world is a crazy place at the moment, as we know. The Russia and Ukraine, Gaza and um, um, Gaza and Hamas. Well, Iran have war with Israel. Who knows why the Israelis attacked the three British workers uh, from the charity place? We don't know. Uh, it could be sabotaged, it could have been the terrorists that done it, I mean, it looked like Israel did it. You never know, at this day and age, or it could have been Israel itself that done it. Why would they do it? So, you know, I'm throwing a lot of this in here as well. Um, I've thrown a bit of war into it as well, and um, into the video. So I'm, I'm trying to mix up, mix it up a bit. You can't see very much at the moment, it's my leg. So some people say, yep, my legs, my legs, my legs. Oh, my two, my legs. My two, my legs. <laughs> yeah, just miles away at the moment. Sometimes it takes a while to just wake up. I mean, I do like my sleep, but I don't want to be sleeping too much, you see, so... I'm going to try and uh, talk a bit longer in the video. I've done about, I think, eight minutes on the video. Uh, this time, at least, I've got a pillow to sit the video up when I'm talking. Before, I have to hold the video up in the air. I need to get a stand or something uh, when I'm doing the news videos and talking in there and doing other things. You know, so there's me put in the bed. Can't see much of a leg, but there we go. <laughs> I don't know if there's much on the TV again, there probably isn't. You know, I always show things on repeat. I always show different channels of stuff, but I'll find something else to put on or something. You know, madness, isn't it? Oh, we look at everybody looks at things differently. Wouldn't it be nice if life was simple, guys and girls, and boys and girls? When you go outside, you expect to meet nice people all the time. Half of the time, you meet idiots. Half of the time, is it where you walk down the road? Half of the time, they just see you as a target as well and take the piss. They think they're big in groups, but when they're by themselves, there's nothing. 
big in numbers, but when you're on, they're on their own, they run away. They ain't got the confidence to face you. It doesn't matter if you're with people or on your own. You know, there's still people out there that are pretty tough and hard. They can knock out three people, one person can. Yeah, there's people like that if you're a boxer or if you know how to fight. Daft people. One always wants to feel brave, doesn't he? But sometimes being brave can uh, do all sorts of things to you. Get into trouble, get locked up in prison. Make you lose your own life for being brave. You know, I don't want people to die, but if you, you die in the war zone, you can, sometimes you die in a gang as well. And this, is, this is true, what I'm saying. And uh, your friends are family, be heartbroken. Some people walk around with a chip on their shoulder and they wonder why people get angry. Yeah. And they say the wrong things at the wrong time to people. There's nothing wrong with having a laugh and a joke and talking to people. But make sure when you're doing it, you don't upset anyone, else, upset anyone else. But some people can't take a laugh and a joke, you see. This day and age. And they think they take everything the wrong way. Like I say, because it is what it is. You, know, you just got to live with things how they are, unfortunately. And uh, I can't really say much about that, to be honest. You can tell my lights on my phone. <laughs> Block nose again. I'll just sit here and just make a video, which I'm doing. You know, talking on the video. <laughs> no, I might do a live stream later. I haven't decided. Went for a long walk yesterday from Sheffield, if not a long way from where I was going to. Um. From the shops and to the um, places that I go to, like in that half an hour walk, I thought, you know, just uh, have a walk. Yeah, it's had a walk. That's all I had really. So all I could really do is walk and just relax and just go out and stuff so walking outside meeting people talking to people and just being me it's all you can be it's all you can be in the world today but not everyone sees it the same way do they they always take things the wrong way. Why do they do it? No one really knows why people take things the wrong way. Because they can't understand the world or understand themselves. Could be more likely. But like I say, um, you know, still filming. Lying in the bed. <clears throat> I need to try and get to bed earlier, but it's not. I'm not finding it easy at all. Like I say, I better go anyway. Thank you for joining me. Listen to my stories and stuff. So I'll make some more videos later. And uh, yeah. Take it easy, people. See you later. Peace.